Welcome back to Star Fox Adventures. Uh, we we, we got to get some things at the store, so uh, yeah. Cool. Have you have you been, man? It's been a while. No kidding. Well, I'm just all curious as to what could possibly be next. You don't even know. Well, uh, first thing <laughs> we're gonna do is we're gonna get some maps. Uh, we don't need these. Uh, moon Pass. We are gonna go direct to the Moon Pass so we can use this spell stone that we have. Let's we'll see if I can haggle with her. No. Uh, I guess. I guess not. Okay, but, uh, I'll sell it to you. All right, four. That's that's good. That's a good price. Seems good. So, are we gonna pass the moon with this new map? Uh, no. But uh, there is uh, going to be a lot of. Actually, it's Moon Mountain Pass. Oh, you tried to trick me. Uh, I, I got you there. Uh, what's strange is that this shop is so weirdly set up. That was the map room, but not all the maps are in there. What? There's still some maps out here. <laughs> we'll, we'll get the Krizoa Palace map, too, because we are going to be heading there, too. Oh, good. Unfinished business. No, mm -hmm. that's too long. Oh, fuck you. So are these, all like, right, the, the intermediate maps in here, or I, I, are they arranged by difficulty? I don't know. They're just fucking random. But you're the expert on this game. I believe I already bought the uh, volcano uh, force point uh, map. We'll be going there too. I think that's all we need. Oh, Cape Claw. We'll probably get this too. You pay this much. We won't be going there too much, but we'll be swinging by there for a little bit. Shit, did I back out of it? <laughs> I guess we didn't get after all. Anyway, uh, I think that's all we need. Oh, one more thing. A high def display device. <laughs> Star Fox is getting an HD TV. <laughs> yeah. This is for uh, something stupid later that I really, really regret doing, and I think uh, the developers really regret doing this too. I can't wait. Yeah, I don't need But that's mine. That's mine, actually. <laughs> I sh you pay this. Fine, just take your. You pay this much and only this much. Take your fucking money and get out of my face. Wow. Let's talk about what we got here. What is this? High def display device. So you can tell it's a uh, pre HD because they call it high def, not HD. Pretty much, you press Z and you can go into a sort of first person mode. Look at stuff. So it's like binoculars. Yeah, you can look at stuff better. It's got a zoom function, it's pretty nice. But it's got the terrible thing of uh, centering right back to center when you let go of the control stick. So it's it's, it's, it's terrible. Alright, let's check out the map here. Uh, where do we need to go? I'll display um, the world map. Scanners well, indicate really helpful, Peppy. I can't tell where I'm supposed to go next. I can tell where I've been and where I'm going to end up going, but I... D doesn't tell where I, need, where I need to go now. It's not very helpful. You just have to remember where you're going. Oh, really? Yeah. Well, I guess that's part of the adventure. The The only right. clue that you have is uh, the sort of checklist you have when you start your file. Uh, you can't see it here. All right, nothing else in here that we need. We're we're stuffed on uh, bomb spores. We're good on mushrooms. We're good on fireflies. I think we're good to leave now, so let's get out of here. And go back to... Uh, where we left off. The best part of the adventure, shopping! If you remember from last time, all of the beacons in Thorntail Hollow have been extinguished. Oh no! no! Oh no, dearie, no me, oh my, oh no! No! So now we gotta go to this fireweed tree right here, which is now suddenly active. Hit that. These things start tumbling down everywhere. Then we gotta hit those, and then there we go. A fucking fireweed. Oh my god. <laughs> it may come in use to help the Thorntails, you know, just maybe. Alright, so there's one. There's three beacons. We need to get a couple more, and there there they go. Alright, let's see if we can. Eh, please please we can tell me we eh, feed these to the dinosaurs. Eh, 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 eh. Well, technically we feed them to the beacons, but uh, we'll, we'll get there. Uh, couldn't get those because they vanished, so let's get another one. I mean, let's try and get it. Don't go in the water! Oh. And they hurt too, by the way. Don't, uh, don't forget that. Uh, they, they, they definitely hurt. And, uh, sometimes you'll just find that you magically got one. Wait, you got that one? 
I thought I did. Maybe I did. I got that one. I got that one too. So, alright. We got the fireweeds. Now to actually light the beacons. Like I said, there's three of them, and they're not exactly hard to find, but, uh... <laughs> this is just another roadblock, just to put the brakes on the game for a little bit before you go to the next part of the game. It's like, okay, so, uh, you, you gotta go to Moon Mountain Pass, but first, do this for a second. And Tricky dug up a, a, a buffum dad, so now we gotta revive. How did you even know that you got those fireweeds? Like, there was nothing indicating that you got them, besides maybe a... Just a sound. A sound, and they appear in your inventory, but, you know, you, won't, you wouldn't know otherwise. Alright, so we got a bomb spore here we're gonna blow open first. Because it's there. And I'm gonna learn how to aim at some point. Maybe. Alright. Uh, and we got some fuel cells. Helpful for later. <gasps> Ooh, what do those do again? Those uh, take you to the other parts of the planet when you get ready to go there. Oh, okay. It's, it's good to get them now before you get another roadblock later when you have to go search around <laughs> finding goddamn fuel cells. Especially when you get to the uh, later levels where they eat a lot of them. So open that. Jump down here. <coughs> anyway. Uh, this is towards Cape Claw. And here's, one, here's our first beacon. What you do is you go to your inventory here. Uh, your inventory. Somewhere. Somewhere. There it is. You put the fire right up there, but we're not done yet. You gotta light it on fire. We need to have Tricky set it on fire. <laughs> as if this wasn't tedious enough. Well, two more to go. <laughs> Tricky, lighter. Yes. I, I, this I thought I was kidding. I thought I was nope. kidding. Nope, nope, nope. This game surprises you. <laughs> Alright, this game got better. Aha. <laughs> did it really? Did it? <laughs> Maybe it did. I don't, I don't know. know. I'm just here for the ride. I'm here for the adventure you say we're going to have. That's right. It's all about the adventure. <laughs> Shut up, Tricky. <laughs> Can that just be your your way to respond to everything? It's all about the adventure and all about the child abuse. <laughs> you said it, not me. Yeah, of course. Next speaking is uh, by the warp stone over here. So it's like, oh, now I know what that thing is. Oh yeah, I remember that thing. All right, tricky, tricky. do your shit. Do, Flame do, do your fucking. Just, you know what to do, don't you? I mean, What's if you've been that? with if you've been with me for this long, you see me put the fire beat on there. I tell you to set it on fire. You know, you think by the next time when I put it on there. You'd probably do it automatically. Answer me this. Are the beacons what? made of wood? I don't know. I don't even know how they get what? made. Why are they not going up in flames when Tricky uses his amazing flamethrower lighter powers? Who makes the beacons if all these thorn tails have thick hoof-like, you know, feet, you know? How, how, how can What do is that? Tricky? I don't know, man. <laughs> what? What kind of abomination suddenly turns purple and knows how to spit fire? Fortunately, That's though, here's our last beacon. We don't have to dwell on this too long. Epiphany. Tricky is a Yoshi. They're so fucking grateful. Yes. The beacons mean so much to my tribe. Please take this. I believe it will help you on your quest. Could have used that earlier, buddy. I'm just thinking that actually fell out of Fox's pocket pocket and he just doesn't notice it this was all a contrived way to get us into moon mountain pass that's all this hey, was point, point a to point b man uh-huh we had to <laughs> visit by what was that tricky laughing at my pain <laughs> so question <laughs> is where the fuck is moon mountain pass let feed this guy first tricky map Good job setting those things on fire, though. You know, you're 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 semi-reliable most of the time. Usually on occasions, tricky. What? Right. So why don't you come with me? In fact, why don't I ride you on your back, like I did the fucking mammoth? 
Oh, to go I'm a to bit the too fucking... tired. I don't want to move anywhere. Get up! Can you take my son with you? Maybe he could, is of noble birth or whatever I said. I'm a bastard, Mom! <laughs> <laughs> oh, well, never mind then. Whoa, whoa, that's getting a bit too uh, rated T here. We need to keep it in the rated E category, thank you very uh, much. Oh, that's where you're wrong, brother, because this game is rated T for teen. <gasps> is oh. it because of Crystal? Oh, thank God. Oh. <laughs> yeah, that makes it a hard T right there. <laughs> no! Stop it! You can tell this is the way to Moon Mountain Pass. First, because of the sign I read, and second, because of all the fucking death mushrooms in the way. That... That means Moon Mountain? Did I miss something? There is a sign that said Moon Mountain Pass. You probably missed oh, okay, it. okay, okay. The uh, death mushrooms are just a bonus. Between all the tough subjects we've had to talk about. <laughs> tough subjects. Now, this is one of several instances I've noticed. I've started to notice in the game. These are just uh, these connecting bits between uh, areas. Like, this is the area between Thorntail Hollow and Moon Mountain Pass. You notice that it's just a roundabout way to go around the level. If, if you want to go one way, you go left. If you want to go another way, you go right. But it takes a long time, it's very tedious, and it's it's just there. You know what I think this is? I think this is a loading screen. Because now we can't, can get, get, we can't get back to Thorntail Hollow now, unless if we were to go through all that shit again. So now we have to go through Moon, Moon Mountain Pass, which has already answer been loaded. Me, answer me this. Another thing? Why were Jeez. you dying? Because it's poison gas. Why would they put that in a loading screen? They had to make it fun. <laughs> you know, it's like how they disguise the loading screens with Metroid Prime's doors and all that shit. That was clever. I gotta tell you, man, though, after that challenge uh, from uh, the mines with, with those barrels, I am sick of barrels. I'm ready to take on some brand new challenges because now we're in a new area, there's new things for us. Uh, we got worry. these two guys here. But, I just gotta tell you, man, I am Somebody fucking died. sick of barrels. No more barrels, am I right? Mm-hmm, yeah, there's gonna be tons of barrels. You make it so obvious. <laughs> oh my god! Release the barrels! And what I love is that they wait... The, the, the cutscene goes on to allow the barrels enough time to get down to me. Oh my god, <laughs> they did! Make sure... To make sure I get the whole experience. Oh. oh! That's terrible! I mean, it's really funny, don't get me wrong, and it's a clever <laughs> way to mask that, but... Oh, come on, guys! So what happens if you skip the cutscene? You probably can't, right? No. No, oh, go figure. But luckily I have a key here. Otherwise I would just go out here and get pelted by barrels all the time. Oh shit, he has the key! Run! Throw more barrels at him! <laughs> is that Peppy? No. <laughs> Peppy is secretly <laughs> working for the dinosaurs. Pe Peppy! You pulled a pigma! <laughs> Throw some more barrels! Alright, Volcano Force Point. This is the way we need to go. Life Force Door. Okay. Adventure. Let's kill some people. Who needs to die? That's, that's such a negative notion, my friend. Well, this is kind of a negative section for me, because I really hate this level, too. Because it's tedious. Very, very tedious. You see those uh, long cracks right there? We can't do anything with them right now. But uh, the way to get the item that we need to do that with takes fucking forever. And it pisses me off. It makes me no happy! Well, clearly you just need to get the spider ball. You just need to ask another Nintendo mascot for help. God, I can't wait for Smash Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> well, uh, so our, uh, so can play our two uh, people we need to kill are right in here. Now we're getting stronger enemies with us. <gasps> oh, no! This guy is huge now. And he took a lot of your health. Yeah, he's a, he very, very powerful, catching on to some of my tricks, and he also has some health, too. See, I had to hit him an extra time. Ooh. Whoa. And they're only going to get harder. They're only going to usually get harder from here on out. Ordinarily, though, they're just going to be these grunts. But that unlocks that, so that's good. Standard level of progression. Good video game design. 
Yeah. I mean, this this is 2002 again, so things are things are different here. A you don't time. have you don't have objectives. You don't have waypoints. You don't have shit like that. You have to go by your own instinct and just what the game gives you. A simpler time when gamer were real men and not yapping about games journalism. Back in my day. Back in my day. Well, now here we are at the volcano force point. I actually kind of have fun with this level. Ah, not Hello? that much fun though! Ow, ow, god, no! Ow, <laughs> god, jeez! I was wondering if you could make that. Apparently you can't. You know, I got someone uh, counting uh, how many times we feed people in this game. Uh, we need to have two more counters going on. How many times we're going to experience barrels, and how many times I'm going to set myself on fire. That's a thing. I'm oh, this is going to be great off. then. All right, let's see. Uh, all right, natural progression. Let's see. That's, that's fire down there. Don't go that way. Now we'll just go down this corridor here and fire. Go fire. Fire now. Down the fire pit. Fuck this. Yeah.